In this morning's Sunrise Spotlight, we are talking about Dreadlight. Dreadlight is a female alternative hard rock duo from Oregon City. They started making music together back in high school when they were 14 and 16 years old, and now it's been more than a decade. They've grown as musicians, playing with big name artists like Alex Lifeson of Rush and Dave Matthews. And we're talking about Dreadlight this morning because they've got a brand new album releasing tomorrow called Chroma. The ladies of Dreadlight are in studio with us, Kander Tolvstad and Toria Beck. Thank you so much for being here, yeah, guys. Thank you. We're okay. so excited. Yeah, very exciting stuff. I've heard a little bit of your music and it is so good. I mean, we talked a little bit about, you know, 14 and 16 years old, you guys started making music together. I mean, you've, you know, gone through so many years and you've, you know, played with various artists, big names like Dave Matthews. How does that feel? Crazy. Yeah. It's totally surreal. I really never thought that we'd even make it to this point. I don't know, we just started playing music in our bedrooms. We were so shy, we'd have to hide under the blanket to share songs with each other because we couldn't look each other in the eye. <laughs> so we've really come a long way and I totally can't believe we've made it this far. It's, yeah, it's wild. Yeah, yeah, a dream come true, yeah, I'm sure. Absolutely. And, and Toria, for people who have you know, listened to a little bit of your music, maybe they haven't, um, what influenced you guys as you've developed your sound? Oh boy. Uh, Bunch of different things. I think Kander came from listening to like the Beatles and classic rock, and I grew up listening to like more harder rock and like Paramore, grunge. Mm. And yeah, we just kind of like came together and it somehow like worked out that, yeah, we kind of developed our own sound from there. <laughs> that is so cool. Okay, and I know we talked about this new um, album coming out. There's going to be a release party that's going to be tomorrow. For people who are interested in going, can you tell them a little bit about it? Yeah, so tomorrow at the Holocene, April 10th. Uh, from 7 to 11, we have an album release show, and this is unlike any show we've ever done. Hmm. Uh, we usually do a very traditional show with just a few bands and then everybody packs up and goes home, but we want this to be more like a party, so we're bringing our friend Maya Wynn to come share the stage with us, and we've got Guitar Hero, there's a bar, there's a taco bar, we've got raffles, we're doing a red carpet photo op. It's a whole thing, we've been planning it for months. <laughs> it's our baby, so we're so excited and we want everyone to show up. Okay, and how much are we talking here? Uh, $10 in advance, $14 at the door. Again all the information up on your screen at Holocene in Southeast Portland. Again, 7 p.m. is when it starts. Yes. Okay. Hope you guys have a blast. Thank you so much for Thank being you. here. Thank you. Hey, I was wondering, are you free tonight? Today was one of those days and nothing felt quite right But no pressure if you'd rather never cross that line I just want to see you I mean I just want to be seen by you So how's it been? How's been sleeping on your own? Something better will never be enough Was the pleasure worth the sever since you messed it up? I don't want to know you If I could never be known by you 